Hello and welcome to the demo for Stick in the Landing, which is a game that uh, I was asked to play some time ago when I was waiting for the demo to come up and then uh, I forgot about it because I was doing Next Fest stuff. So anyway, here I am to do this. It's a puzzle game, so I, I just kind of want to just skip everything and... What did I do? Uh, oh, because it's basically like a tutorial thing. They were doing the story bits to get us where we're going. All right, well. I get it. You want me to do a planet so we can take advantage, wait, and begin. I have, uh, I guess you have to get it exactly where they want you to, to have it. Change speed. What is that? What is that? Tab? I think it's tab. Well, I hope it's not like a whole lot of tutorials. What happens if we crash into the planet? Well, uh, if we crash into the planet, that would be bad. Um, I feel like the gravity for this planet might be a little bit a little bit too much for what it is. I don't know. I I definitely feel as though it's a little bit stronger than I would like. Alright, demo world. There's 23 levels. Alright, well let's see how many we can get. Alright, you wanna you wanna grab the thing? Sure. I didn't get the star, but whatever. Uh, for me, like, I don't really find myself too concerned with getting all the stars. I don't really know what exactly they're going to do. I feel like I'm not going to get any of the stars. Maybe that's going to be my goal, is to get zero stars the entire time. At least they allow you to finish the levels without it. I'll be honest, and um, I don't think a lot of this matters in the way that you would think. It's probably because, like, I I'm not going for a single one of the uh, the stars. It just doesn't really seem to be something that's uh, all that necessary. Is that... Uh, nope, I go towards it. Alright. Uh, is that my only planet? Hold on. Yep, 
No, we get the um, tomatoes, I guess. Seriously? I mean, I guess you like, you know, I, I don't know. I mean, I could keep doing this, but it would take minutes and I would still get nowhere. Um, yeah, I, you know, it's ironic because I did a decent job at uh, physics when I was in high school. Uh, I did a really terrible job at geometry. I did okay with um, calculus and stuff in college, but I really don't like, I don't enjoy the math. I think I don't really care for orbital mechanics either. Um, can I skip a level? Let's see. Let's go to level selector. Maybe we can skip a level. Okay, good. I can. So I guess I can say that, I mean, overall, I would say it seems to be a pretty cool uh, game. Nice little bit of puzzle, um, puzzle-oriented stuff with, uh, you know, orbital mechanics, almost. Uh, not really my... Not really my forte, I guess you could say. So this, this shoots it upwards, I... I think, like, I, I don't know, I feel like all the eggs are going to shoot me upwards. Which is not what I want. Maybe that'll reverse it. Now, I don't know, I... I don't really get it uh, as far as like how these planets are affecting gravity. Uh, let's just try number whatever I just clicked on 10. Ah, no, I'm not even going to bother. Obviously, uh, this is um, completely beyond my capabilities as a person who's not um, terribly into puzzle games at times. Yeah, I just I'm not good at it and I'm not going to spend any more time trying to be good at it. So, um. The link is in the description. If you want to try it, I encourage you to do so. If you like it, wishlist it. Um, and that's all. That's all I have for this.